April 21st, 2009, Anfield, 19 minutes of madness, Liverpool fighting for the title, Arsenal fighting for pride, and then this guy showed up to destroy it all. Four goals against a team that was supposed to win the Premier League. But who even is Arshavin and how did he end up being this guy? Let me take you a few years back. Zenit St. Petersburg, Arshavin was already making waves in Russia. People knew he had something special, but no one saw this coming. Zenit wasn't exactly the global powerhouse, but somehow they had this magician, a guy who could create something out of nothing. Then came Euro 2008, Russia versus the Netherlands. And guess who showed up again? Our man, Arshavin. He took out a Dutch team that had names like Van Nistelrooy and Van der Sar. He wasn't just playing, he was outplaying them. Arshavin! The little maestro carries them into the semi-finals! He's a he did the same thing against Sweden to qualify his team for quarterfinals. So, it's no surprise that Arsenal came calling in 2009. Arsenal fans were buzzing. Is this the guy to bring the title home? Well, not exactly, but he gave us something we'll never forget. Let's go back to that night. Liverpool was chasing the title, and here comes Arshavin, just casually deciding to score his first Premier League hat-trick. And then, because why not, he scores a fourth. First, a poacher's goal. Then, boom, a rocket from the edge of the box. The third textbook counter-attack. And the fourth, absolute chaos at Anfield. Liverpool defenders were looking around like, is this guy serious? The craziest part, after the game, Ashavin looked like he just came back from a Sunday stroll. Barely broke a sweat. But Ashavin wasn't just a one-night wonder. His start at Arsenal was electric. The man knew how to turn it on. At Arsenal, Arshavin had these moments of absolute brilliance. He wasn't a traditional number 10, wasn't a winger, wasn't a striker. He was just Arshavin. Played back for Arshavin! 2-1! They've turned it round! You never knew what you were going to get, but that's what made him special. And that night at Anfield, that was peak Arshavin, when everything clicked. He turned a game that should have been all about Liverpool's title challenge into a one-man show. Four goals in 90 minutes, no one saw it coming. His career didn't have the fairy tale ending. After returning to Zenit, the magic wasn't the same. Injuries form he never quite hit the heights again. But even if he faded, that night will always be part of Premier League folklore. Mysterious, brilliant, goofy, unpredictable. One night, he's tearing apart Liverpool at Anfield. The next, he's disappearing on a cold, rainy night in Stoke. But for those who watched him at his best, we'll always remember 